Sometimes it was his money and I would make it up to him through housekeeping. That's one of the reasons I got the KY. I still wanted to memorialize them in some way, so I laid them out and I photographed them. I'd never had glasses my entire life. And in 2010, I put on someone else's just for fun and it was like, I didn't even know that you could see the world that way. I had a foundation cover up, something that was very opaque that I was putting on them from that point on. I knew I was going to be arrested. We are back to the cheerful and helpful Jody. Uh, the same kind of Jody who uh, very, very eager to talk to that Detective Flores. Remember when she was lying through her teeth? Um, days after killing Travis Alexander, she offered that detective so much information. Let's go to a body language expert, uh, the very patient Patty Wood. Thank you for your patience, ma'am. Um, we see her on the stand today handling a situation that would make a lot of us, you know, go into the fetal position and just, like, melt down. And she's poised and she's calm. I, I, there's something about this chick that I don't get. Can you explain it? Absolutely. What's fascinating, getting small is what we do when we're fearful. When we're scared, the body actually wants to compress down, make itself a smaller target. And that's what's so distressing. Her body language actually, she's energized by all answering all these questions. She's smiling. She has what I call up body language. Her chest is out. She's actually proud in some of her answers. When she goes through all of that testimony and the answers about having her painting in a gallery, she's actually glowing and her words are flowing out so easily. When somebody is fearful, there's so much tension in their body, they might freeze in place. You'll notice today she's not doing what she did when she was crying last week. There's no hiding in her hair. There's no blocking her faced with her hand. She's had time to prepare these answers. I think that's important for us to know. And she is really having fun with this whole process at times. Well, well Patty, I, I must say a couple of things. It. You're saying that she's actually enjoying this whole process. Yes. And I don't know when she prepared. We only found out about the, the number of questions yesterday, and they were debating them this morning. I mean, does she, is she... <laughs> working overnight without sleep to prepare answers? Or does she have a gift to spew anything like many pathological liars do? They have a gift. They they process the information. They spew out the lie. There's there's no pause. And it's it's a perverse gift. And, and I think she's got it. She answers these questions without a blink.